So at this time, we will move into item A1, uh, a proclamation recognizing Fred Gensler for his service to the Brentwood community. And if you could meet us up, the vice mayor and I are gonna present uh, Fred. I'm not going to say a lot. I'm going to let the proclamation speak. But Fred, I have known Fred for many years now. Uh, when I first moved to town, he was working at the press. And anytime I walked downtown, it seemed that he was there. And then I found out that he was involved in so many other areas in the community. And when I got to be a part of the very first youth in government uh, that, that I got to attend as a council person, I found out that it was Fred's brainchild and baby, and he ushered it into fruition and let us have what we have now. And he's also a lion. <laughs> and from a personal note, Fred is one of the most genuine, precious individuals uh, that I've ever met. He loves people and he serves people. Uh, and he wants uh, not just a community, but every individual in that community uh, to have a happy, prosperous, and peaceful life. And he does that, and he shows it by the way he lives his life. And it is my honor to call you my friend. And I'm going to read a proclamation, and I'm going to allow the vice mayor, after the proclamation, to speak. As well, you know, why don't you speak before the proclamation so we can gather ourselves? So I've, I've ooh, that's loud. Uh, I've known uh, Lion Fred for quite a few years, too. We met when I was working at the press with him and bonded over Friday afternoon margaritas. <laughs> After hours, of course, and nobody drove home, and seriously. Um, but Fred... <laughs> Press was a very interesting place to work, and there was always a lot of ups and downs and interesting news happening and lots of personalities and drama, and Fred was a very entertaining way to get through that with some um, grace and some peace and, and some chuckles, too. So I'll never forget that part of you, and then got reintroduced to you as a Brentwood Lion, as my husband and I are now Brentwood Lions as well. So feel incredibly lucky to have uh, reentered your universe and become a part of your world again, Lion Fred. And uh, I continue to be inspired by you and the work that you do and your presence in the community and all the things that you've done that nobody really knows about, all the things that we aren't talking about tonight. We honor you tonight for all of that. Thank you. Whereas in 2003, Fred Gensler moved to the city of Brentwood immediately immersed himself in the community and joined the Brentwood Lions Club. And whereas in 2004, Brentwood co-chaired the first Youth in Government program and the first Diabetes Awareness Walk in Brentwood. And whereas from 2011 through 2013, Fred served as the president of the Lions Club. And whereas in 2015, Fred was awarded the recognition of Lion of the Year as well as the highest honor from the Lions Club with a progressive Melvin Jones Fellowship. And whereas in 2016, Fred received the second Brentwood Chamber of Commerce's Community Service Award. And whereas over the past 20 years, Fred has participated in dozens of charitable events and has acted as a liaison between the city of Brentwood and the Brentwood Lions Club, supporting various city events. And whereas in April 2023, Fred co-chaired his 14th Youth in Government program, which has encouraged many students to take an interest in their community and plays a part in developing our future leaders, now therefore be it proclaimed that the City Council of the City of Brentwood hereby thanks Fred Gensler for his invaluable contributions to the Brentwood community and his dedication to its youth. Thank you, Fred. Thank you, thank you. Just a few words. Um, 
20 years ago, the city council meetings were far different than what we're experiencing <laughs> tonight. Uh, uh, there was no contention about anything. We just, everybody got along. Uh, but this is a, a far more interesting uh, approach to city government. And uh, I really appreciate it. I re appreciate all of you. You, you. You're not getting paid to do this. Uh, it's just your, your love of Brentwood. Uh, but other than that, I don't think I deserve this proclamation. But thank you. Thank you all very much. Thank you. If we can move over here and make sure we get some photographs.